Bills in your At this time, I ask that you put your eyes and remove your hats from your heads as we honor America with the plane of our Greenwood High School Air Force Junior. And now for the starting lineups, first for the visitors, the Alma Lady Airedales. A senior, number four, Cassidy Cooper. A junior, number 13, Zoe McGee. A sophomore, number 23, McKaylee Dowdy. A sophomore, number 24, Lauren Kelly. And a junior, number 32, Hillary Mata. Lady Ariels are coached by head coach Cody Mann, assisted by Paige Jones.
Turnover, possession, Lady Arrows. On number 13, Zoe McGee. That's her second foul. At the line, three to number 23, Kenley Fisher. Free throws up and good. And so, uh, second one is good. Three on the play. No good rebound, just a poop. 
And Cooper will work the ball into the front court. Now throws down to go. Cooper left court to uh, McGee. McGee's got two persons. McGee goes inside. She's blocked. This running back goes away. Saved by Mata. Mata for three. Got the under good even belongs to Greenwood. Pushing the issue. Number 23. That's her second. They got a bunch of girls, so they don't really worry too much about personal fouls. So the ball is uh, missed on the shot. Here comes Greenwood over the direction. It's Julian. She drives. Nice pass to the paint. Six and it's 13 to nothing. The problem here, they got a really nice scoreboard, but they shut it off too quick, and so uh, you don't know what the time is at the clock is. Loose shot on the other direction. Here comes Greenwood. Jillian drives, kicks the left side. Three on the way. And now no good rebound belongs to McGee. McGee pushes left side. It's stolen. Coming glass. She wants to finish up off the glass. So we got 2:56 to go in the opening quarter. It's Greenwood 15, Alma. With Alma basketball here on the Marshall 96.7.
Higgins comes in for Alma. For Alma. He's going to be Kelly. I mean, if they keep it open that door down here to my left, they're going to have to build a fire. I don't know what the temperature is outside, but it's cold right here at the floor. And my wife will tell you that I'm a wimp, so that doesn't matter too much. Sign pass goes down to Kelly. Kelly, she's picked up. Cooper tries to get away on it. cut off by her own player. Cooper goes on top. of possible pass goes to Craven. He gets kicked out of bounds. 121 to go in the opening quarter. Greenwood 17. Alma has not scored. On top goes to Cooper for three off the back of the end. Another rebound with Alex Greenwood. Here comes Greenwood in the other direction, pushing the issue. And layup is good. Two of the one basket, number 23, Kingley Fisher. And it's 19 to nothing. Craven had a look at the three, didn't take it, passes inside, off the back of the line. Maybe Greenwood's going to push it on the direction. Nice pass, left side. Two of the one basket, number 23, Kingley Fisher. And it's 21 nothing. With 40 seconds to go in the opening quarter. Greenwood works for All right, I'm going to look. There's a hand in the back. Look off right wings for three. Off the eye, no good. And rebound belongs to Greenwood, and there's no one on there. Layup is missed. And McGee's going to have it. McGee is knocked to the floor. She gets back up. Layup off the glass and good by Kelly. And Kelly hits with 15 seconds to go, and it's 21 to 2. Greenwood plays the last shot. Right side looks. Glass. There's a screen. And that's it. So we played a quarter. So after the end of the first quarter, it's Greenwood. Kelly's going to be 21. Check his number. He's going to be Do you have me? Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, we're uh, running it off on the right. We're going to come to the second quarter. So, whenever you're ready to come back, this is right. Okay. Especially if this drummer doesn't keep beating the drum. Trail 21 to 2. I uh, got a jump ball, uh, and possession is going to belong to Greenwood. And uh, trying to get all my scoring intact. So Lady Bulldogs down the three ball on the way off the iron. No good rebound belongs to Greenwood. It's Stein. Three on the way off the iron. No good rebound belongs to Greenwood. Julian. Yeah, girl wide open and right, they won't get it through. Looking back at Goodwin now. Cross court. Pass goes towards Fisher. Three on the way, off the iron, no good. That hits the support. How good Greenwood is. Uh, they're third in our conference. And um, I mean they're solid, they're a solid third because the first two teams are unbelievable. And so this is just how tough the girls' conference is. 
So McGee uh, into the front court, a loose ball. She's able to recover. Cross court pass goes to Mata, almost stolen. Baseline to Cravens, Cravens, and she's hacked. Now we'll have a foul on the floor. The foul is on number 15, And that's on uh, Shockey, that's her first. Number 14, Maggie That's their uh, fourth team foul. Charge to uh, the Lady Bulldogs. Mata, excuse me, Mata with it. McGee for three, and will not fall. Double up in the back court, and Greenwood's going to break the pressure. Greenwood in the front court. Ladies move. It's going to be going to Shockey. Penetration drive by Goodwin. Kicks out three on the way, and it's good. And it's a 24 to two ball game. Alma drives, looks to Mata, kicks inside. And we're going to have a turnover. Have a change of possession there. Uh, Andre Holmes uh, had the ball. And uh, yeah, taken away from her, but possession is going to go down. So in the game for Alma is going to be uh, Dowdy's in and also checking in for Alma. It's going to be uh, uh, Ariel Towns Robinson. Well, we can't move. We need some help. Doubled up. Pass. Right side goes to... Maybe it does miss. And oh, they got a foul. They got that call. The uh, good rebound by Alma. Towns Robinson on the rebound. And so Roselle, she picks up the uh, foul. So Towns Robinson with the free throw, and it's off the back of the iron and they'll go up. Second shot's up on the way. And this one, off the back of the iron and they'll get him here and belongs to Greenwood. They got way too much for an ADD kid on this board going on. I'm having a problem figuring out what's what. Mata pushes. Robinson off the glass and good. And Ariel Towns Robinson gets the score. And it's 24 to 4. 540 to go in the opening half. Three. Boom. Shocking. She was uh, way down there when she popped that one in. And that makes it a 27 to four game. Pass court, almost stolen, and it's probably off Alma, I think. Nope, it's gonna stay with Alma. Almost lost it. On the inbound. It's uh, Mata. They'd keep these doors closed around here and people wouldn't freeze. That's the problem when they build these facilities is they leave access to the floor. There's a turnaround, shots no good, and the rebound belongs to Greenwood. They did the Bulldogs into the front court. Penetration drive, three ball. In and out, no good rebound. Belongs to Alma on the rebound. That was Kelly. And Kelly will get it into the front court of McGee. Left side, baseline. Three on the way, no good. Rebound belongs to Greenwood. Greenwood pushes. It's a one on two, no, but it comes back. Layup is good. Two And Saki makes it 29. To four, turnover. Here comes Greenwood the other direction. Court. 4.15 to go in the quarter. Goodwin drives. Layups up. No good. Rebound belongs to Towns Robinson. And there's a foul in the backcourt. The foul's on number 32, Susanna Stein. And that's on Stein. That'll be Stein's first. So for Alma, 
Coleman in the front court. It's going to be Cooper. Left side, Hounds Robinson looks, she pumps, goes away, loose ball, and we've got a player for Trophy. On oh, no, Ari, yeah, and that'll be her first. Offensive foul, charts number 11, Hounds Robinson. Into the game for the Lady Bulldogs, number 10, Angela Price, 11, Adam Julie. 23, Kimberly Fisher. Tell you this: If you uh, sit at a ball game here, you freeze. They keep opening these doors around here, and it's colder in the in here than it's probably outside. We got access to the outside. That's a hard thing. Right side penetration, almost stolen away. Stayed uh, stayed by Fisher. Fisher goes three on the way from. Saki makes it a 32-4 ball game. Turnover in the backcourt, layup. Now I'm under the front court, loose ball. It's going to be a layup on the other direction if we don't throw it away. And it's good. By Saki. Saki makes it 36 to 4. There's a foul. That's going to be on 23. And that foul is going to be charged to Fisher. Fisher picks up the foul. That's the uh, 16th foul. I'm going to be in the bonus after this. Alma trying to inbound. Needs some help. Throws it towards the midpoint. It's uh, Cooper. Baseline pass. Duncan's got it. She's cut off. Cravens. Nice pass inside. Shots up and missed. Put back is no good in the rebound. Belongs to Greenwood. Lay up on the other direction. No good. And we got a foul. And it's probably going to be on Dowdy, is my guess. Nope, it's going to be on number, on number four, four Cooper. At the line, two, number 15, Alan Sutton. So that's the fourth team foul on Alma. Free throw by Saki is in and out. No good. She's got, uh, she's got 10 in the quarter, 10 in the game. Second one's on the way, and this one's off the front of the iron. No good in the rebound belongs to Alma. It'll be Dowdy. Dowdy works at the front court, goes to Cooper. Cooper looks to drive, and she's hacked from the back, and she's going to be called for the walk. Greenwood in the front court. It's Fisher. Price looked at the three. Didn't pop it. Three on the way. Off the iron. No good. Rebound belongs to Alma. The foul is going to be on. That was going to be on number five. That's on Terry. That's going to be her first person. That's the seventh team foul, I think. Yep. The only thing they've done wrong is uh, get us in the free throw situation. But other than that, they just dominate. So Duncan's at the free throw line. Free throw's up and good. And it makes it 36 to 5. Second in and out. No good rebound belongs to Terry. Greenwood into the front court. Right side goes to Saki for three off the iron. No good. And Cooper with the rebound. Cooper. No, oh, she's cut off the back. We got a foul in the back court. And the ball is going to belong to uh, Alma. Uh, now we're over the free throw line. At the line, shooting one and one, number four, Cassidy Cooper. That foul's going to be on number 22. Nope, it's going to be on number 11. Oh, 
So at the line is Cooper. Free throws on the way, off the iron, no good. Rebound belongs to Greenwood. Greenwood, three. Off the front of the iron, no good rebound. Belongs to Greenwood, a little bit is tougher than we are. Rips it out of the hands, three ball. Off the iron, no good. Again, loses. Alma's trying to play tough, but it's not physical enough. Greenwood is tough. Three on the way. This one's good. And it makes it a 39 to 5 ball game. Loose ball in the backcourt. Turnover. And we're going to have a jump ball. Possession change. And so Alma will not have possession. We've got 122 to go in the, in the first half. Greenwood 39, Alma 5. Greenwood number 25, Greenwood in the front court. It's uh, Fisher. Fisher looks to drive. She walks. They're going to call a bump. It's going to be on Cooper. And that Cooper. That will be her second. So uh, we got two for Fisher. First one's up off the front of the iron, rolls around and falls away. Second shot is rolls around and not again, not good. And Alma with the ball. It's Towns Robinson on the rebound. Goes left side to Cooper and Alma tries to move it in and we just threw it away back court. Didn't get it in and throw it back court. So Greenwood works it into the front court. We're under, uh, under a minute to go in the opening half. And we've got a possession change on the jump ball as Alma fights for the, uh, for the jump. Alma scored three in the quarter. Gives us five for the game. And we trail 39 to five. Pass down low on the baseline, and it's to Duncan, and it goes through her hands. And we've got a turnover. <coughs> Greenwood in the front court. Pass inside, spin move, or holding all over. She can't have a chance to score. Cooper drives. She's cut off. Goes back to... Cravens, and Cravens throws one up and she gets fouled. And that foul is going to be on Terry. So Cravens is at the line. The first one's off the back of the iron and does not fall. Second free throw off the front of the iron, no good. Rebound belongs to Greenwood. Lady Bulldogs into the front court. 15 seconds to go in the first half. Julian, she drives. Floaters up and good. And we play the half. So at the end of the half. Greenwood, and Alma, five. We'll be back in 60 seconds with scoring here at the Alma Basketball on the Marshall 96.7. Yes, please.
ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the board for your halftime entertainment, your room, Jazzler! Well, we put a little jazz going on here. We got a little music being played, and it's a uh, halftime routine. It's the uh, dance theme for Greenwood's doing their thing. And so, but uh, it's fast, and there's not a lot of uh, excitement going on for Elma. Uh, we throw 41 to 5. Uh, yes, that is correct, 41 to 5 to Greenwood. And Greenwood is uh, 84 in the conference season, 16 and 8 over the season, or overall. Allen just uh, has not been able to beat uh, the season. So for Allen, he's not even high by so We've got five points. Uh, Warren Kelly's got two. Mario Towns Robinson's got two. And Ann Conductor, she's got a point. For Greenwood, uh, they scored a lot. They've got 41, and uh, they're head big at halftime. So we're going to go back to the station. Uh, we're going to come back. Uh, let's see here in, uh, let's say, eight minutes for the second half of Allen High School basketball. Hale Marshall, 96.7. Yeah, seven minutes, maybe. Let's hear it one more time for your blue. 
Yeah, we're good. Okay, so welcome back to the Marshall 96.7. Here on the FM dial and uh, Alma High School basketball, Tony McMurray, voice of your Airedales. <laughs> What's left of his voice trying to fight through this crud? Uh, we're the cold and flu season, but Alma is uh, getting thumped here uh, by Greenwood, and it's 40 41 to 5. Uh, we just, uh, they, there's three really good teams in our conference, uh, and everybody knew that going into it. Uh, what it is, you had Little Rock, uh, or you had, uh, you had Little Rock Christian uh, was was pretty good. Uh, you had um, this team here, you had Greenwood, and then of course, uh, there's one more from uh, down in the south. I'll think of that in a second. I can even see his name, see his face right now, but Greenwood's kind of uh, put the thumper on it, so uh, they're pretty good. And so uh, they're leading uh, 41 to five uh, here in the third quarter. Officials are talking about uh, what we're gonna be doing uh, to start the second half. So Baloney girls uh, was who I was thinking about, and they are uh, they are uh, they've not lost, and so so we're gonna have a running running half, and uh, it'll be quick. Tommy Kraft just promised me it'll be quick, and so uh, but uh, saw this happen earlier. Uh, Bologna, let's see, uh, <coughs> Little Rock Christian, uh, they were playing and they were getting beat. Uh, I believe it wasn't uh, wasn't my by Greenwood, uh, but they were getting beat at halftime by 30, and so they put a running clock on the second half of that game, and I think that team was actually in maybe fifth, fourth or fifth in our conference, just because you how good the girls are. So, so we're ready to go. And uh, possession arrow is going to belong to Greenwood to start the half. So Greenwood, they have possession to start. They lead uh, again, 41 to five. In the front court is going to be Fisher. Alma's going to be in a two-three zone. Drive on the base, nothing there. Tipped out of bounds, and loose ball belongs to Alma. So we're going to let the clock run. Uh, both coaches have agreed. Um, it's a 30, 36 point game. So uh, mutual respect and uh, Alma basketball will come back. Uh, we've got some kids that play hard. Loose ball, turnover, and we're going to have a jump ball. Possession. Belongs to Alma. Cooper, she's going to fight hard uh, regardless of what happens. Into the front court. Goes down to Dowdy. Dowdy looks. Cross court pass goes to McGee. Baseline. Dowdy needs to look. We don't get many opportunities. And, and we bumped her out of bounds and stepped out of bounds. That's a good call because the clock's going to run. Out of bounds, turn over to Greenwood. So Julian walks it into the front court. Greenwood leads. By 36. Three on the way. Off the iron, no good rebound belongs to Mata. Mata right side. And Elma cannot hang on to it. Here comes Price. Price, left side, and they throw the ball away. And there's another turnover. A couple of subs coming in for Elma. Into the game for Elma. Number 10, Tyler Ravens. Number 11, Larry Ravens. Ravens. Checks in for Elma. McGee, she's doubled up, 
goes out. Three on the way. Off the iron and no good. Rebound belongs to Greenwood. Foul's going to be on 10, I guess. Foul's on number 10. I'll be on Cravens. And so Cravens picks up the foul. That's inside stolen by Alma. Here comes the Lady Eardells. He's going to go to Cravens. She wants to go coast to coast. Off the glass, no good rebound through the legs. Towns Robinson with the putback. Two point basket, number 11, Ariel Towns Robinson. And Ariel Towns Robinson now has six in the game. We got a timeout. So we got uh, we got 4:43 to go here in the third timeout. quarter. Greenwood, Greenwood 41, Alma 7. Back in 30 seconds. That's your prediction. So uh, we're back. We've got uh, 4.43 to go in the third quarter. Greenwood 41, Alma 7. Lady Bulldogs uh, took a timeout. Didn't like what they saw. And uh, did get some hustle. So they make a change. Now goes to Fisher. Fisher looks inside. Goes back left side. Three on the way is good. Three, Price. And Price makes it uh, 44 to something game. That is 44 to 7. Alma loose ball. Tipped out of bounds, but Alma maintains possession. Got a running clock for the second half. Uh, this has happened uh, more than once this year in our girls' league because uh, there's three teams that just really good. There's a foul on 24. That ought to be on Kelly. I think she gave her a push. Fouls on number 24, Lauren Kelly. Her first team And second. so that'd be Kelly's. That's her first. That's the second team foul. It's going to be Fisher. Back to Julian. Alma's in a man. Oh, they just opened the doors outside and it got cold. There's a drive up off the glass, block, rebound, stays with Alma. Goes to Glass. Glass, three pointer. No good rebound, Greenwood. Three ball on the way, no good. Alma with the rebound. Julian with the foul, and it was a pretty aggressive, uh, pretty aggressive foul for a team that's ahead by 37 points. Rebound, ball goes out of bounds, belongs to belongs to Greenwood. into the front court. Saki. Left side almost stolen. Ball bounces. Goes down to Julian. Saki with the ball. Pass. Baseline shots on the way and it's good. By Stein. And we got a foul on the floor. Clemens picks up her first foul. 
They're going to pressure at the uh, trap at midcourt. Ball goes to Towns Robinson. She looks to drive. Passes to Andrea Holmes. Three on the way. No good. Long board. And it belongs to Greenwood. Out of bounds. Greenwood in the front court goes to Julian. Baseline pass inside. Shots up. Nope. Pulled back. Goes down to Julian. She's doubled up. Stolen by Towns Robinson. And the layup is good. And Ariel Towns Robinson has, she's got six of her points. That's Price. She's picked by Clement. Down to 20 seconds. Three ball on the way. Good. And Price makes it 49 to 9. Ravens loses it. Needs some help. Thrown away. Other direction. Snowbird going to down. Layup is good by 15. And we played three. After the end of three, it's going to be Greenwood 50. And your Lady Airedale's 19. Excuse me, 9. We'll be back in 60 seconds. Thanks. Yeah, we've got a running clock for both the third and fourth quarter for the girls' game. And uh, one of the coldest places I've been this year. Uh, the door just gets open. <laughs> I can't think much about it. Uh, the temperature outside is uh, 36. The wind chill is 27. And uh, it's wet. It's wet, wet, wet. Turnover. Shots up, no good. Greenwood comes to the front. We got to figure out who uh, who's in the game. Shots up, no good. Another shot, good. That's about fourteen. And Roselle gets a tray. Out of bounds, the last touch by the lady. Ball belongs to Greenwood on the uh, possession. Clement on the uh, play. The defense by Elm. So we got 32 seconds to go, or three, three minutes to go in the game. I wish it was 32 seconds. Layups up and good by number 15. Basket, number 15, Alex Saki. Saki. All right, Towns Robinson, she's going to get bumped. We're going to have a foul there on Greenwood. Roselle gets the foul. 
56 to 9. Uh, just under 5 minutes and 53 seconds to go. Cal Robinson with the floater. It's no good. Here comes Greenwood in the other direction. It's going to be Clement. Down a good one. Clement shots up. No good rebound. Number 11. So Julian gets the basket and she's got one free throw. And it's good. And it makes it a 58. 59. Ball game. Days Greg Grant would be helping me do the game, and he'd take his headset off to get a dig at one of the officials. I'm just taking my headset off so I can breathe. Three ball on the way, nice little shot. It's up, no good rebound belongs to Greenwood. A good board by the Lady Bulldogs. Good one drives, left hand layups, no good. And the board belongs to Towns Robinson. She goes, 12 footers up, no good rebound. Towns Robinson, she puts it back, and it doesn't fall. And so uh, Ariel Towns Robinson is at the line for Elma. And she makes the first. And Elma is in double digits. We've got 10 points. It's 59 to 10. Game couldn't get over quick enough. Fifty-nine to eleven, stolen by Alma. Nope, stolen by Greenwood. All just kind of wandered around for a while before anybody picked it up. It's Clement. Drive left, three on the way. Off the iron, no good. Rebound belongs to number twenty-four for Alma. That's on Kelly. She gets the board. Stein picks up the foul. So Greenwood, uh, they're going to win this one. They're going to move to. They're going to move to 17 and 8 on the season. They're going to be 9 and 4 in conference. They're in third place in the conference. How good this conference is. For Emma. Ball goes to Plurid. Looks, baseline, tipped out of bounds, stays with Alma. It stays with Elma. It's one of those where you get the ball and just take off and go somewhere. Stacy in the game. <coughs> Loose ball, tipped out of bounds, stays with Elma. Uh, 20 seconds to go. Ball goes down to Stacy. Three on the way. No good. Rebound belongs to Greenwood. Here comes Greenwood in the front. 
Fleming. Loose ball on the floor. Everybody's going to fight for it. It's going to be rolling around for a while. And Alma's going to come away with it. Here comes Alma. Clear. Wants to go to the hole. Up off the glass. No good. Kelly. Shots up. No good. Rebound belongs to Greenwood. 40 seconds to go. Loose ball out of bounds. And Greenwood walks it into the front court. Clement. She's picked up by Plurd. Good job by Kylie. Loose ball stolen. By Alma with Duncan on the steal. Somebody needs to pop one We're about a time. Plurd puts one up. And it's short. And that's the ball game. So the final score is going to be Greenwood.
minutes until the start of the boys game. Yeah, three minutes, so. Whenever you're ready. Okay, so welcome back to Elma High School Basketball in the Marshall. Uh, 96.7. And uh, we're ready to start the senior boys game. Last time these two guys played, uh, Alma pulled out a 61-43 win over uh, Greenwood. So, uh, it was a good game, uh, pretty, pretty even uh, for the most part. You know, we never could pull away first quarter. Uh, Greenwood scored, uh, four, scored seven. And Alma only had 11, so it was, uh, it was pretty nip and tuck. Uh, Alma, uh, at the end of the third quarter, uh, we led by... Six, and then uh, we're able to uh, put a little scoring spree on. 
and get the W. So, but uh, for Elma, uh, it's a road, it's a road uh, game. It's a big game for Elma. Uh, we're sitting currently uh, tied for, or actually, actually we're in fourth place by ourselves. And so, we uh, need to win tonight. Connection for a second, but we're good. Balls on the baseline belongs to Christian. Allen doubles, shots on the way off the glass, no good. Peter with the rebound. Here comes Peter. He goes ahead to Shelton, passes to Winfrey up off the glass, no good rebound. Tip by Alma, and Peter's going to have it. Peter, three ball on the way off the iron, no good. Bobby Winfrey with the rebound. Winfrey. Goes to Mann. Goes to Shelton. Shelton. Taylor Peter looks. Can't handle it. Taylor goes on top. Winfrey. Winfrey back to DJ. George bump. No call. With Bobby's got it. Bobby tries to cross over. Nothing there. It's going to be on the floor. And we're going to have a possession. It's going to be a jump ball. And the ball's going to belong to Alma. Jump ball. Possession. Alma. Into the game for the ball. Number 20. So we think we got everything going. The uh, Air Dolls lead two to nothing. So under the front court belongs uh, Greenwood. Bulldogs need some help. Shots up. No good. Foul's going to be on Winfrey. Foul's on number five, Bobby Winfrey. It's first at the line, two, two, number 20, Chase Garner. So at the line is uh, Garns. Free throws up. No good. That going for Garns. Off the iron, no good rebound belongs to Shelton. Alma to the front. Layup by man, he's fouled. And that's going to put Alma at the free throw line. Fouls on number 20, Chase Garns. His first. At the line, 2-2, number 20, Chase Garns. 
Second free throw's good. That's a 7-2 game. You said Christian won? Yeah. 71-58. Loose ball. Peter, he's got the steal. C.J. Mann with the layup is good. Off the steal. And we got a timeout. So... 4.59 to go here in the first quarter. Alma 8. Greenwood 2. We're back in. Got luck. We'll be back in 40. Go, 30, please. My apologies. I'm making up numbers. Okay, so welcome back to Alma Basketball here on the Marshall. 96.7, Alma's leading here in the uh, first quarter. It's a 9-2 game. I got some subs in for Greenwood uh, off that dead ball. Bulldogs. Trying to work, which goes to Garns. Cross court pass to Russell. Alma's in a man. Good job by the Airedales. High screen. Hampton, well, he's forcing his way in. He's going to get the layout. Hampton just kind of bulls his way into that one. Pass goes to Winfrey. Kisses it off the glass. And good. And Bobby makes it a 10 to 5 game, or 10 to 4 game. <laughs> Was in a man. Ball goes to Hampton. Right side Garns. I got a little screen. Looking low, trying to feed uh, Gaston. Good job by Al on the defense. There's a drive. That's oh, nice cut back door. Like it, by Russell. Winfrey. And Winfrey with the touch. Now the lead's 12, 12 to 8. Excuse me, 12 to 6. Lawrence. Three ball on the way. Good. By Hampton. That was a nice touch. Came off the screen. Turn around. And popped it. So now the lead's 12 6. 
top. Now we'll look to the screen. We've got a double hand check in. Winfrey off the glass. So no good rebound belongs to Green. Well, here come the Bulldogs. Alma leads by three. Bulldogs in the front court. Three on the way. No good rebound belongs to Shelton. Shelton wants to go make a lap. He loses the ball. There's a give me for them. I appreciate that. They help us out on that foul. That's on Garn. That'd be his second. So into uh, into the game for Alma is going to be Austin Cluck. Also uh, in the Alma's uh, lineup is going to be Nathan Wade. Ball inbounded to Cluck. Shelton looks at the base. I'm always riding him. You might have to call that. He's bushing. This is bumping the right there. So it'll be a turnover. It's uh, Airedale's lead 12 8 or 12 9. Ringwood into the front. Johnson, who gets cut off. All right, there's a three on the way, uncontested. Gonna have no good rebound belongs to Greenwood. Lap is up and good. Shelton throws one up and he that's gonna roll out. Good call. One four to go in the open quarter. That was lead by one. And 12 of that. Bulldogs get a screen high. Cut three, nothing. Shots up, no good. Rebound belongs to George. George goes to Clock. Clock needs to find someone. He's cut off on the baseline. Goes to man for three. Good. CJ puts him up. Good turn. By Hampton. Alma comes back with three of their own. By Peter. And it's at 18. Uh, let's see, it's 18 14. Darns. 35 seconds to go. Loose ball on the floor. Baseline. Laps up and good. And it's 18 16. Three for the Eagles on the way. Good. Big bucket. Power block. And that's the end of the quarter. After one, the ADL is 21. The Bulldogs 16. We're back in 30 seconds. That's the end of the first period. We're still Bulldogs 16. So we've had a couple of buzzers sound. Here it goes. And uh, about ready to put by uh, 
ball back in play. The Airedales, uh, they lead 21 to 16. For Alma on the floor, it's Peter, it's Man, George, Cluck, and I missed my other one. Well, they force feed that one, not going to happen. Good save by Alma. Palin's going to be doubling the bottom. He can't do anything. He's going to reset the offense. Peter looks at the three from downtown. Shots up and good. By Palin Peter. Taylor with three. He makes it 24 16. Greenwood's going to answer with a three of their own. And it's no good. Rebound belongs to Clark. Here comes Alma. George. Three on the way from Alma. And the balls are going to belong to three on the baseball. In the game for the Bulldogs, number five, Dalton Russell. Number 21, Jack Gaston. 24-16, Alma leads by eight. Greenwood gets a screen, set shot on the way, off the iron, no good, and the rebound belongs to Alma. George with the rebound. Pass inside, and right in Austin. Out of bounds, possession goal. In the game for Alma, number one, Andrew Shelton. Number five, Bobby Winfrey. Winfrey needed some stick up on his fingers. Excuse me, that wasn't Winfrey, that was... Uh, Nathan White, I need a little stick them on him, but he lost it. So the Airedales lead 24-16. We're looking at 6.40 to go here in the first half. Alma's in a man. Trying to roll off the screen. Alma switches. Good job by Alma. There's a nice high ball screen. And uh, they didn't kick the pass like they're looking for. There's a walk, turnover on the Bulldogs. George, excuse me, uh, it's going to be man with the ball. Shelton looks to go, up off the glass. Now it looks like a jump ball, but he gets it back, and he's going to be fouled. Fouls on number 20, Chris Norris. That's Chris Norris. At the line, 2-2, number one, Tanner Shelton. That's Norris' uh, third person. Free throw's good by Shelton. In the game before the Bulldogs, number 13, Evan Parker. Sheldon Sekulins, off the front of the iron, goes around and drops. And the Airedales lead 26 16. Gaston, he's got it. Looked at the back door, couldn't find it. Christian wants to drive. He's cut off by Shelton. Good job by Alma. Bartlett. He's in. Gets a screen. On top. Alma, good j job on the defense. They're going to go inside. 12 footer up. No good. Rebound belongs to the Airedales. Peter. Pass ahead to Shelton, and he loses it out of bounds. Airedales by 10, 26-16, 5-18 to go here in the first half. Russell, well, they just missed the back door pass. They had a Gaston open, and they missed it. And they throw that one over here to uh, Tommy Pratt, our official. Good save, so uh, it's a turnover. 
So, Peter, he will inbound, and he goes to Winfrey. Bobby Winfrey with the ball. Bobby looks to drive. On top to Peter, back to Mann. Mann wants to drive. Long cross court pass. Three on the way. In and out, no good rebound. Saved and goes to Greenwood. Also, the game for the Bulldogs, number 25. The ball went everywhere but down. And uh, Alma needed that one. Bulldogs into the front court. We got 420 to go. Alma leads 26 16. Uh, yeah, 26 16. Good screen. They just ran over us. That's a good no call. I guess we got bodies everywhere and they're just laying down. So hey, we'll be all right. So it's going to be a uh, man walking the ball in the front court. He looks, he's going in for the layup and it's good by CJ. And we got a timeout. So 30 second timeout. Here with, uh, let's see, 401 to go here in the first half. It's Alma. Oh, it's going to be a full. So it's Alma, 28. And Greenwood, 16. We'll be back in 60 seconds. <laughs> 60, please. So welcome back to Alma High School Basketball. The uh, turnover forced by the Airedales. Uh, give the Airedales possession again. And uh, Alma. Wilma had the ball. They playing a little defense. Cut off by the officials. A drive baseline. Loose ball. Maybe a jump. And that's what we're going to call. We're going to call a jump ball. At the 346 mark. On the inbound, long pass, tip stays with Greenwood, it was Hampton, he's looking inside to Christian, Arrows lead by 12, screen on top, rolls off of it, shot's good. By Hampton. And Alma turns it over. We got 320 to go in the first half. You know, when you build these gyms, you need to build like a, a door that keeps people from coming in and out. And, well, Animals got that, but nobody else does. You sit down here on the bay on the, on the floor, just freezing because they just the open the outside world world just open to us. Three on the way off the iron, no good rebound belongs to Green. Well, he didn't even move, and it came right to him. And this is this one, Peter with the rebound. Here comes Peter, goes to George. George looks on the top, goes to CJ. Man drives. Nice pass to Bobby. Off the glass, no good, and the rebound belongs to Greenwood. And we got a loose ball foul. Foul's on number five, Bobby Winfrey. That'd be Winfrey picking up his second foul. That's only the second foul in the air that was. So we 
got, uh, let's see, 2.40 to go. Alma leads by 11. Stone with the ball. There's a big screen. Shots up no good. Rebound belongs to Peter. Peter works past his guy, and that's a charge the whole way. He made up his mind he was going to run over him, and he did. So Peter, <laughs> Peter's down. He came down hard, and uh, so we're going to go back to we're going to go to the station for about 30 seconds. So we'll be back in 30 with Alma High School basketball here on the Marshall 96.7. Thirty, please. So uh, welcome back to Hero Basketball. We're leading 28-19. We've got um, 220 to go in the first half. Greenwood's ball. Bulldogs. Gaston's in the game. Ligon's in. Look at Stone. Well, they got the big kid in now. 24. I to find his name out. Three. No good. Rebound. That's gonna be a foul on number 24. Saved by the Airedales. George with it. They're going to double him up, doesn't. Goes down to Shelton. Shelton pump fakes. Now shoots a three. Good. And Tanner with a three. And Tanner. Puts Alma up 31 19. With 120 to go here in the first half. Goes to Hampton. Almost goes to the coach Flinter on the far side. Good save by the uh, Greenwood bench. Three ball on the way. Good. <laughs> it's Hampton. And he literally has all the points. Man drives, loses it off his leg, comes back to George. George goes, needs some help, goes back to CJ for three. Good. Big battle for Man. Needed that one. And the Adele's up 34-12. Shots up, 22. Oh, say it, Tanner, save it. Do it to Waylon, he couldn't hang on to it. Ten point lead, 20 seconds to go. Alma needs to get out of this one to our lead. And Greenwood's going to play for the last. Get a screen. Now it's illegal because he's moving. Good job by Alma. And we're falling, but no call. And so we played a half. So at the end of the first half, the score is Green is Alma 34, Greenwood 24. Back in 60 seconds with first half. Power. Sixty. Yep.
Okay, so it's halftime in the Airedale's lead here at halftime, 34-24. Uh, Ten-point lead, and uh, any lead on the road is good. Uh, so for Alma, at halftime, a scoring spread around. we got 2-4, 7 Shelton in the first half. Ladies and gentlemen, nine. we're waiting on a technical issue to be resolved. In the meantime, can I draw your attention to the students in the house? Excuse me, Peter. Peter had nine. Uh, Winfrey has scored. Uh, Clock has three. And the CJ Mann has, has 11. For uh, Greenwood, leading score for Bulldogs is uh, Hampton. Hampton's got, uh, he's got 16 and a half, and that's about it. So nobody's in foul trouble for either team. Uh, we did have one player go down pretty hard. Uh, that was uh, that was uh, Peter, so maybe he'll be able to play in the second half. So, so Alma's ahead in half. 34-24, uh, way back in, let's see, six minutes with the second half of Alma High School basketball. And here we go. Six, please.
anytime you are, we're good. Other than the fact that it's freezing on this basketball floor. They, they leave the doors open. So welcome back down to High School Basketball in the air. We'll start with possession to start the second half. Waiting to, uh, don't know what we're waiting on. Now we're ready. So the Airedales will inbound. Goes on top to Peter. Looks inside down. There's a, he got a main, well, he's bumping. We're not going to call that one. Shelton looks to drive. Shelton cut off on the baseline. Peter for three. Off the front of the eye, no good. Rebound, Winfrey. He fights for it. There's a body on the floor. There's a no call. And the ball stays with Alma as it's tipped out of bounds. There it is, lead by 10 here at half. Shelton looks, he wants to drive, and he loses it out of bounds and saved by a cheerleader. But the ball belongs to Elma. And wow, we just threw it right to him on the inbounds. Good, good play by Greenwood on the steal. Bulldogs. They've got Russell in the game. Also, they got gas. Alma's in a man. Well, they just missed the back door. Open three ball on the way. In and out. Nope, calls in. And Garns. Nails it. Shelton on the other end. It's in and out. No good. And we have a foul on Winter. He's got a hand in the back. That'd be Bobby Sturr. Third. Bobby's third personal. So, I'd have to address that situation before we get too much deeper into what's going on. Three on the way, no good rebound belongs to Peter. Here comes the Airedales into the front. CJ tries to go past this man. He gets cut off. Got a knee. Whoops. Some got all sorts of stuff banging into the radio here. Foul charge to 21. Gaston. Man with it. Three on the way. Off the iron. No good. And the rebound belongs to. Greenwood, Emma leads 54-27. Looks inside the guards. Good job by Alma. Pass inside. Kept waiting for Garns to spin, but he didn't. Russell with it. Almost loses it out of bounds. Good job by Alma on defense. Russell. They're going to go inside to uh, Big Man. Stay up. Stay up. There you go. Good job. Good job by the Airedales on defense there. Russell resets the offense. He gives to Garns. On the floor, shots up. No good rebound. Tipped out of bounds and stays with uh, Greenwood. Out of bounds. Bulldogs looked at a back door, nothing there. Hampton for three, and it's good. He's my uh, he's my horse player. Right, I'll lead by six. She's gonna lead by four. Shots up, missed. Thank you. 
Oh, Mickey yeah. takes up a loose ball foul. Adams lead 34. 30, six point game. Bulldogs work it up. It's Christian. Back door screen. Trying to get, uh, looks like number 11, trying to get Hampton over. Good job by the Airedales. Kicks up to Gaston. Shots on the way, no good rebound. Belongs to Alma. Rebound belongs to Peter. Alma to the front, Alma needs a bucket. Man wants to go, can't. Tight for three. No good rebound belongs to the Bulldogs. Here comes Greenwood. And the shot's up, and no good. Rebound belongs to the Airedales. Here comes Cluck. Tailing for three. No good. Good rebound by Austin Cluck. And we got a timeout. So 3.57 to go here in the third quarter. Alma Alma leads 36-30. We're back in 60 seconds with Alma basketball here on the Marshall. 96-7. My name is Candace Porter, and I'm the owner of Arkansas Cheer Academy. I love the Alma Cheer Academy. I love the I didn't have anybody picking that one up, but a good job on uh, making him change direction. Ball comes into CJ. Man goes inside, and it's Stoke. Tried to feed it down to, uh, to Wood. Defense made a better play. Hamill leads by six. 3.25 to go in the third quarter. On top. Gaston. Boy, he just missed the flash through on Liggett. Stone, he's picked up by Shelton. It's Ligon again. Picked up by Man. He wants to drive to the hole. Nice play. By Didn't see that one coming from anywhere. And the Airedales lead by four. 36-32. Man in the front court. Gets the screen, goes to Shelton. Got his guy and boy's hands are just up on his head. And we lost it out of bounds. Good pick. And we lost it. A couple of songs in for your Airedales. Coach Flynn is trying to have a little heart to heart over there, but he's not getting much love from uh, So the uh, Airedales, uh, we had to get a substitution going in. Took us a while to figure out who was wanting to do what. So in the backcourt, here comes Greenwood. Allen leads 36-32. Bulldogs. 
Stone with the ball. High screen. Waiting picks it up. Screen low ball. Goes to Hampton. Good job by the Airedales on defense. Missed the back door. Drives, loses. Nope. Able to maintain. Front fake. Shots up. No good rebound belongs to Alma. Comes the Airedales into the front court. Clock. Man, he's going to be off balance, and we got a foul. In fact, Wayman went up, and he gets fouled. Foul's on number 21, Jack Gaston. That's on Gaston. That'll be his third. Number 24, And that puts Wayman at the line. Wayman's free throw is off the back of the iron, and no good. Wayne has got a second. And this one is good. Next one out of two, the Airedales lead. 37-32. Greenwood. Oh, they just missed the flash. Baseline goes down. Johnson. Three ball. Is an air ball. We didn't pick it up, and they're going to score right there. Nope. In and out. The big boy. Misses. Tip. And the oh, man, they're stripping. Man, Greenwood's on the board. A little bit more physical than the air goes Man with the screen looks at George. George had a three, did not take it. He was wide, wide, and wide open. Man drives. He needs some help. He might have got away with the wall. George needs some help. Goes to Wayne. Shelton, and that's a bump on the floor. And that one. It's on Ligon. Couple subs coming in for Greenwood. George will be inbounding under the Alma basket. Alma leads by five. Oh, uh, just go up, Cluck. There you go. Austin Cluck. Puts Alma back up. 39-35. Almost stolen. Well, that's a good no call, man. We got almost caught all the way through the screen. 35 seconds to go. Fished it. Going to get a high screen up. He's going to try to drive on the baseline. He's cut off. That's Hampton that's cut off. Hampton hits it. And Alma leads by four. 39-35 with 15 seconds to go. Man with the ball. Looks to the front. Got Shelton. Tanner's going to have to drive. We're out of time. Winfrey's going to have to shoot. And that's it. So we play three. Greenwood.
right, so welcome back down to basketball here on the Marshall. 96.7, the Airdos lead 39-35 going into the fourth quarter. On the inbound, it's going to be Gasty. Again, uh, boom. to the three. He was open and uh, took it. Man goes. He's blocked. All stays are down. Let's see. It's going to be a man on the inbound. Goes back. Clock. Clock needs some help. And for three, in and out, no good. Rebound. We got a reach on Alma. And that's going to be uh, Bobby Winfrey. That's a good look. It just didn't ball. Alma leads uh, by one, 39-38. Bulldogs into the front. Stone. And a man. On oh, top goes to Christian. Oh, they missed the back door. Oh, they got his guy pinned. Gone. He's got it. Goes up to Gaston. Hampton, he's just got all three. He's too close to be shooting. And Alma tips it out of bounds on Greenwood. In the game for 652 in the ball game, Alma leads 39-38. Been a pretty um, the game pretty much resembles outside uh, temperature-wise. So Winfrey goes to C.J. Mann and goes right side goes to George. And Alma just dribbles it out of bounds. That was uh, Peter. And he dribbles out of bounds. Here come the Bulldogs. They got a chance to take the lead with 6.20 to go. Shots up, no good, rebound. Well, we got knocked to the floor. It's going to be on number 21. It's going to be Gaston on the foul. And Alma with the loose ball. Foul on number 21, Jack Gaston. His fourth foul, team So the Ariel still lead, 39-38. 6.09 to go. Needs a high screen. And man, that was not a good well, they almost took it in the day. There's a lazy inbound or a lazy pass and they lose it. Stone. Greenwood's got a chance to get the lead. Looking for the high screen. Hampton's the one that you gotta watch. He's the one that's done the damage tonight. Christian almost dribbles out of bounds. Saves. Ball goes right side. Garns. He's picked up by Winfrey. Garns drives, wraps up, and no good rebound. Belongs to Alma. And we got a foul in the back court. That's on Garns. So that'll be his uh, fourth. <laughs> Peter inbounding the backcourt. Airedales still lead 39 38. Just over five to go. Gotta have some help. Almost threw it away. Peter for three. Yeah, no good. Rebound. Alma fights for it, and the loose ball goes to 
The Bulldogs. That's a walk. How they didn't call that one, I don't know. They missed the walk right here. Man. Foul so Winfrey picks up the foul. And that's his fifth. We'll take a time out. After we have a so uh, we got 4:47 to go in the ball game. Alma leads 39-38. We'll be back in 30 seconds with Alma basketball on the Marshall. On the Marshall 96.7. down the basketball there. Dale's trail 40-39 uh, to uh, the Bulldogs. Man tries to drive. He's cut off. Goes to clock. Clock. There's a hand check. That's what we're asking behind. Get your hands off of him. That's a bump. Man for three. In and out. No good. Rebound belongs to Greenwood. Here come the Bulldogs. Three on one break. Great job. And we draw the charge. That's Gassi. That's his fifth person, so he's just fouled out. And I think that's the sixth. Sixteen back. So the eight outs. Four, uh, four, let's see. Four, let's see. Oh, that's a block. That's a block underneath. That's a good call. Four minutes to go. It's a 39 40 game now. Leads by one. And if the line is going to be man. Now the lead's by one, 40 39. He does no good. This one falls. They just have six points and a half. And we're at 40 apiece. Bulldogs. With it, Ligon. Need some help. It's a stone with the ball. They get a screen on the backside. 
We have a guy that just wouldn't get out of the lane. Our people wanted him to get out of the lane. He just, oh, he had a flash almost still. Not Greenwood. Just stay down. They're going to throw one up. And Shelton at the ball. Shelton pulls down the rebound. Needs to slow it down just a little bit. Goes to the big man and Raylan. With the layup and good. And Airedale's up 42-40. 3-10 to go. Now one by two. Ligon. Ball goes back to Stone. Baseline goes to Ligon. Trying to figure out who their uh, player is on the baseline. There's a the screen. There's the shooter. He walked. And the rebound belongs to Mann. Mann with the ball. Mann into the front court. CJ. Goes in for the layup. And good. And Mann with the layup. And we got a timeout, so. Official timeout. No, we have an official timeout. In the game for Bulldogs number 20, James Not sure what that was about, but. Airedale's lead 44-40. Three thirty-five to go. Stone. He's looking inside. Drops down the guard. Stone. Garns is the score. On top goes to Bartlett. Baseline. Wayne straight up. Got a block. And he draws the foul. The foul is on number 24, Nathan Wallen, his first. At the line, two to two, number 20, Jason Garns. So that puts Garns at the line. Garns makes the first. There those lead. Second one's no good. Rebound belongs to Alma. And that foul is going to be away. Waiting. So they're not in the bonus. Bulldogs. Three on the way north. Close. Picked out of bounds by Greenwood. Nope. Picked out by Alma. 148 to go. Alma 44. Greenwood. 40. Now we're going to have a timeout, I think. We got a timeout. So 148 to go. Alma 44. Greenwood 41, we're back in 30 seconds. Oh, 60 seconds with Alma High School Basketball. Time out, Greenwood. Four, time out. Sixty. They were standing, now they're sitting. And I've had my jacket on the entire second half. That's how cold it is in this place. And they got, yeah, they got fan, they got fans on it. It's like, gosh, it's like 12 degrees. I mean, it's cold out here. But, yeah. down with basketball and uh, ball belongs out of bounds. There goes lead by three. Screen on the baseline. Oh, well, they just missed it. And Shelton with the turn up. Loose ball. And they're going to have a jump ball. Maybe a timeout. Possession belongs to Alma. The 
sweat on the floor. The so we got 1.43 to go. Alma leads by three. We got the uh, perspiration wiped up. I can promise you there's no perspiration for sitting now because it's just cold. They open the doors and um, you had the head congestion, you know it's not much fun. So, but Greenwood's digging in. Going to be man with the ball. Looking to go one on one. Ball goes to loose ball. That's all right. Goes to clock. Clock off the glass. No call. Alma forces that one. Here comes the Bulldogs. Christian. There's a drive. Christian. Stolen by. Nope. Almost. Kicked out of bounds. Good job by George. So that 106 to go. One oh six. Greenwood with the ball. And else lead by three. Defense! 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 Well, we just bailed him out. Man. He picks up the foul. And that puts uh Garns. Half the line, three throws up, and good. And it's 44-42. It goes by two. Second shot, no good. Rebound belongs to Man. So the air does with the ball. We're under 60. Get Shelton. They're bumping him. Come on, Tanner. Tanner. Needs some help. Well, nobody's going to pick him up. Now they're going to go to George. We're going to spread it out. And that foul is going to be on Christian. Baseball and belongs to Greenwood. Here come the Bulldogs. Working up the other way. Stone. And we got a timeout. So 20 seconds exactly to go. It's Greenwood 44, Alma 42. We're back in 30 seconds with Alma High School basketball. Thanks.
block, and Waden with the block, and he gets fouled on the baseline. Nathan Waden with a big block. Great job by Nathan. Seconds to go there. Dells lead by two. Garns. And we're going to have a timeout by the Airdale. So we got 10 seconds to go in the game. Alma 44, Greenwood 42, we're back in 60 seconds. Timeout, Alma. 30 seconds. Timeout. Hey, just 30 seconds, 30 seconds. Yeah. 30. They switch me. So we're in the bonus. Barnes at one. He goes on the way. And it's in now. No good. Rebound belongs to Alma. And on the rebound for the Airedales was DJ George. And that foul is charged to number 13, Bartlett. He's got a double bonus. Three throws on the way, and it's good. And I'll leave 45-42. Second one is good. And Coach Flinders is going to take a timeout right here. So, Airdos lead 46 42. We're back in 60 seconds with Alma High School basketball here on the Marshall 96 1 7. Uh, full timeout, 60 seconds. Yeah, 60. back off the ball a little bit. Ball 
was in play. Boy, he took off for a five-yard run. Three ball on the way. It's no good rebound. Belongs to Whalen. And he gets fouled. Nathan Whalen with the rebound. And that's the ball game. The final score is going to be your Airedales, 46. I got to get that right in there. The final score is going to be your Airedales, 46. 42. Well, they're going to have to do something here. I don't know what they're doing. Why are they going to shoot this? Wayland's going to get to shoot two. I don't. Number 24, We're going to put two seconds back on the clock. So, Wayland shots up, and it's not any good. Second free throw for Wayland. All he got to do is make one. And he doesn't. The buzzer, buzzer's going to go off, and that's the ball game. The final score will be your Airedales, 46, and the Bulldogs, 42, back in 60 seconds to wrap things up. Thanks. That's the end of the game. Your final score, Greenwood Bulldogs, 42, not the Airedales.